Republican House panel today working on a bill to block United States aid to a number of Middle Eastern nations. Unless and until the White House can assure Congress that those nations are cooperating in the war on terror. The legislation would block billions of dollars in aid to Pakistan unless that country can prove that it's pursuing terrorists, among other conditions. Many in Congress have questioned Pakistan's cooperation with the United States in light of the raid that killed Osama bin Laden. Of course, the world's most wanted terrorist was living near Pakistan's equivalent of West Point. Molly Henneberg, live in Washington. This bill puts conditions on Pakistan. What are they, Molly? Hi, Chef. For one thing, it would require Pakistan to prove and the U.S. Secretary of State to confirm that the Pakistanis are genuinely helping out in tracking down terrorists and helping out in the investigation into how bin Laden was able to hide out there for so many years. The GOP chairwoman of the committee says the restrictions are necessary to make sure Pakistan uses U.S. aid, quote, in the right way. If they want to receive U.S. dollars, there's no longer a blank check. It's no longer business as usual. They have to respond to our questions. They have to cooperate. They have to share information, or the buck stops here. The bill also would put conditions on aid to Egypt, Lebanon, Yemen, and the Palestinian Authority, although it does include a provision to allow the president to waive the requirements for reasons of national security. All right, well, Chef? some Democrats have some reservations about this, right? In part because it would apply to aid on all levels, military, intelligence, and civilian assistance. And the top Democrat on the committee, Congressman Howard Berman, contends that U.S. dollars that help strengthen Pakistani civilian institutions are, quote, the key to long-term stability in that country. This measure may pass the House, which is controlled by Republicans, but has a tougher climb in the democratically controlled Senate. Chef? Molly